Hello, I'm Isabelle Corville. I'm the president of Hydro-Québec Transénergie. We operate one of the most uh, important transmission network in uh, North America. The challenges we face are significant. That's why we articulate the talent of all of our scientists and engineers to help us innovate and build the best network uh, that we can for, uh, for our customers. We're proud to share with you one of those innovations, the Line Scout, a robot that is inspecting live transmission line. This is an innovation that we've uh, developed in our own laboratory, but we have used uh, the uh, collaboration of BCTC to do the field testing. I'm Janet Woodruff, President of British Columbia Transmission Corporation. We are constantly looking to innovation and technology to help us get the maximum value from what we do. That's the exact reason why we were so excited to partner with Hydro-Quebec on the testing and refinement of the Line Scout, a technology that will help us do more with less. British Columbia's grid traverses some of the most difficult terrains on Earth that makes the line inspections needed for our aging infrastructure difficult and expensive. The Line Scout technology has the potential to save time and money, delivering a real benefit to the people of BC. We are so pleased to share with you the highlights of our Line Scout technology partnership. The Line Scout is the only robot in operation today on high power, active, live transmission lines. We became aware of the Line Scout uh, through our scan of uh, development of technologies uh, really around the world and identified uh, Hydro-Quebec uh, as an organization that had done some interesting work in the area of uh, robotic inspection. The idea was to design a system that would profoundly transform the way we do line inspection and line maintenance. And this is exactly what we delivered. What it allows you to do is to be on the conductor providing uh, exceptional point of views, allows you to measure things like uh, the electrical resistance of the splices. It allows you to bring sensors very close to the component. It allows you to intervene on components also, so you can repair a conductor, you can uh, also unscrew bolted assembly. It allows you to work away from the dangers that would be represented by the energized components, but also damaged structures like uh, broken strands on conductors or over ground wires. Worker safety is paramount. Now this new tool allows the light maintenance personnel to perform their duties remotely from the power line, so without being exposed to the uh, harsh condition in which these, uh, these systems are operating. You can gain video images of the line and inspect the conductor at 360 degrees all the way around. The resolution you get with the Line Scout robot in the line inspection is unequal in the world. This allows you to improve the ability of doing either preventive or corrective maintenance. Line Scout actually can perform visual and infrared inspections. So when the line is energized, we are looking for infrared images, so-called hotspots, to identify potential problems. It also allows you to bring back these images to the ground, and then you've got two, three maintenance personnel looking at it. You archive these images, and then one week later, you, in the office, you've got a whole bunch of engineers looking at the problem. The Line Scout has a GPS uh, locator, so we can exactly locate the particular deficiency, so we can repair them later. This increases the reliability of your lines, the availability, sustainability of your operations. We use the Line Scout technology to inspect the Indian Arm Crossing, which is an ocean inlet crossing at the lower mainland in British Columbia. It's one of the major challenges in our operation to maintain this particular transmission item. It uh, provided an opportunity to attach the Line Scout on an energized conductor. The robot has the capability to uh, walk around obstructions and this provided an opportunity to demonstrate that. We found uh, damaged and frayed conductors um, and through the process we were actually able to, to undertake minor repairs uh, on the conductor and uh, avoid the risk of having to send a, a technician out on the line. So the safety advantages were uh, absolutely tremendous. The line scout performed extremely well, beyond our expectation, 
and delivered great visual and infrared images for our recordings and inspection data set. We did confirm with the Indian Arm Crossing that the Line Scout is the tool for that kind of intervention. BCTC and Hydropovec took big risks implementing this technology in BCTC's operation. But this risk-taking delivered great value for both BCTC and Hydro Quebec and for the technology. The partnership with BCTC was really tremendous. First of all, it allowed us to demonstrate what we have done within the context of Hydro Quebec was also applicable anywhere else in the world. The Line Scout robot is today very different from what it would have been without this partnership. To us, the Line Scout is a first step in the demonstration as to how robotics can play a very significant role in how our uh, transmission industry evolves in the 21st century. BCTC and Hydro-Quebec partnership did bring the light on this technology and now there's a lot of people that are looking at this saying this is the future of power line maintenance. It's going to change profoundly the way we do things.